Hey family, I'm back with another video. My name is Matt. Remember to watch till the end of the video for more information about the giveaway on this channel. Remember to like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and follow me on Instagram. The link is below. Let's jump into this video. In this series, we are walking through the seven areas to set goals in. In the last video, we talked about family. So remember, there is seven areas. This is gonna be number two of seven. Number two of seven. Now, it's gonna be in the social area. The social is very important for a bunch of different reasons. Now, before we get into the social area, let's review the seven areas to set goals in. Number one, family. Number two, social. Number three, career. Number four, spiritual. Number five, financial. Six is physical. Seven is intellectual slash mental, which is extremely important. So for social goals, social goals are super important because you need a great group of friends to walk with you through life, you know, through the ups, through the downs, through the good times, through the challenging times. So it's always important to have a really good group of friends to rely on. So social goals can, can be construed in many different ways. You want to hang out with people. You know, you want to go to dinner. You want to do group events. You want to just hang out with your friends. You know, have a church group. Have a, like, there's so many different things you can do. For me personally, you know, I have a church group. I have a friend group. You know, I've made friends through college, you know, from high school. You know, all different sorts of places. Oh, and basketball and sports. If you want to do intramural sports. You know, maybe you want to join a sports league or do something up that alley. It's kind of cool because if you can find something that you like, so let's say, example, hiking or biking or video games, and then you, you just got to find people who like that too, and then, you know, you'll have one thing in common already, so then you can kind of build a relationship slash friendship from there. So it's super important to do these things because, you know, you want to be able to hang out with people, and, you know, people make your life rich, so it's very important to be able to hang out with people and, you know, create good friendships, long-lasting friendships. You know, I have many friendships that have been over, you know, 10 years and I'm, I'm young. So, you know, I met them in, you know, third grade or fourth grade or fifth grade. And, you know, we're still friends to this day. So it's really cool. You want to have those long lasting friendships, but you've known people for, you know, since you're in middle school or high school or even you're in 20s to 30s, you know, it's awesome to meet people along the way and just, you know, figure out, you know, what their experience is, what your experience was. You know, that's kind of one of my favorite things to do of all time is just sit with somebody and have a good conversation you know, about life or about what's going on with them or, you know, just different things. Get to know the person, you know, give, give more than you take. You know, that's kind of a, a a simple life motto. So, you know, all seven of these areas mix together. It's really important to understand that, you know, they all rate, relate to each other in so many different ways. So it's really important to, you know, go through all seven areas, really be, um, honest with yourself on like which ones you're good at, which ones you're not good at, because at the end of the day, all seven of these areas mix together. So it's really important to understand that and to make sure that you're focused on all seven areas to, you know, create a rounded good life for yourself. So next we're going to do examples of social goals. We'll do two examples. Uh, example number one is going to be maybe you want to hang out with a certain friend more. So, you know, you gotta, you gotta write it down. Obviously you gotta say, okay, in 2021, I want to go to dinner with this friend, you know, once a month. So, you know, I'm going to call them, ask them what's going on, see how they're doing and schedule a date to go on, you know, to dinner with, you know, go to dinner with them once a month. You know, that's huge. You know, that's going to create a relationship uh, that is invaluable and good forever. Right. So that's kind of cool to do that. So I would highly recommend doing that. And uh, let's, let's do number two. So number two, the second example, would be to join a join a group of some sort. You know, in 2021, I'm gonna find a group of people who like to exercise. I'm gonna find a group of people who wanna read books. I'm gonna find a group of people who want to play video games. I'm gonna find a group of people who wanna swim. You know, something that you guys all can relate to. And then you're gonna join that group, you're gonna make friends, you know, you're gonna go consistently. Now you gotta make sure you're going consistently to the group. You know, go once a week, go once every two weeks. It's super important. For example, my church group, we meet once a week and, you know, it kind of keeps the relationship going and, you know, we're all friends and, you know, I've been going for a couple years, right? So building those long relationships is really important, right? So I do advise you, you know, get yourself in a social group, a, a social gathering, you know, make sure, you know, you're reaching out to people, you know, make sure you're reaching out to friends, see, you know, see who, like make a list of, you know, who do you want to be your friend? You know, do you even know who you want to be your friend? You know, figure out who, who's your friend you want to be your friend you know reach out to them say hey like we should hang out or something you know a friendly reminder you know what i mean it's really it's really the small things that matter 
So social is a big part of social is a big part of the seven areas that you need to set goals in just for many reasons, you know. Having, you know, a good social life and a good social group will greatly enhance your life, I'm telling you. Very important. Okay, guys, so that's kind of it for this area of uh, goal setting. Uh, now let's talk about the giveaway real quick, okay? There's a $100 Visa gift card giveaway, and we're going to do that at, when we get to 1,000 family members. So that's going to be really cool. So like, subscribe, share, follow me on Instagram. Let's get to 1,000 family members, and then I'm going to do a $100 Visa gift card giveaway. That would be really cool. All right, guys, that's all for today's video. Remember, continually to work to become the best version of yourself, and we'll see you in the next one.